Hello there. In today's lesson, I'll guide you through a classic technique for finally turning the position of individual items along the main axis. We'll be using a reliable method of matching auto. While the values just like content values are very convenient, they might not always produce the exact layout you desire. For instance, you might not want the items to be laid out across the container as shown here. Maybe you prefer to have the home and such elements on the left hand side, while place logout on the right hand side. Achieving this specific arrangement isn't achievable with the existing just like content values alone. To restart, let's remove the justify content property, causing all items to butt up on the left, which is the default layout. Next, we'll focus on shifting the logout item to the right. To achieve this, we need to specifically target the logout item. To facilitate this, I have assigned class names to all three items, home, search, and logout. Now, to adjust the logout item's positioning, you can target it using its class and apply a margin on the left hand side, setting it to auto. This manipulation will effectively push the logout item to the far right hand side of the container. The space you currently see represent the left margin of the logout item. This method demonstrates how I typically position individual items along the main axis. If your goal is to place both the logout and the search item on the right hand side, we can easily target the search item instead. By removing the margin from the logout, it will return to the default layout. Then simply apply a left margin to the search item. Be sure to place the search item before the logout item in the markup to ensure the correct sequence. This action, at the same time, will shift the logout item to the right hand side as it adds a margin to its left side. Now, I'd like to give you a small task. Firstly, I will remove this particular adjustment, then I will set the just like content to flex end, pushing all the items to the right hand side. Your task is to reposition the home item to the left hand side, achieving this by applying a margin to the home item. Go ahead and make this adjustment. Once you are done, you can resume the screen quest. I'll be waiting to provide the solution when you are ready. Great job! If you follow along and make the adjustment, you've successfully moved the home item from this position to the left hand side. The trick was to add a margin on each right side using margin right auto. This shift is evident from this space here to its new position. With that, we've wrapped up this lecture. If you have any question or need any further clarification, don't hesitate to reach out. Keep up with the good work. In the upcoming lecture, get ready to explore an exciting property called Flex. This property holds the key to achieving responsibility within for individual items. I'm looking forward to diving in into this with you. See you there.